Hi, welcome to Two Jews on Film. I'm Joan. And I'm John. And the film we're reviewing tonight is the beautiful foreign film called Beautiful, spelled B-I-U-T-I-F-U-L, starring Javier Bardem, and it's directed by, oh, that incredible director, I'm going to get his name right, Alessandro González Ineato. Olé! <laughs> He where's did, my where's my bull where's my bullfighting jacket? Okay. He, he okay. did wait, wait wait he did Babel, and this well, and uh, Javier Bardem. He's created more Babel with this movie. Oh my God, John! I'm going to tell you what happened here. This is what happened in the theater, and this was an omen of what was to come. Um, <laughs> the the movie's two and a half hours long, which is fine. I mean, if people have yeah. that that it's a little on the long side. It's a beautiful film. But the movie started, they had the wrong they had the wrong lens on the on the projector, so everybody looked like an egg. <laughs> and then they tried it again and there was no there were no subtitles. So what started as a 2 hour two and a half hour thing was now go, going to two two fifty before I even was able to get started. That has nothing and it was starting to late. do with this. This is a movie. Javier Bardem is a is extraordinary a, actor. Well, I, I don't know if I go extraordinary. I think he's very competent and he's definitely what? a watchable actor. And oh yes. Women, women seem to really oh, love God, him. Oh God, he's so. But this hot. movie, so this hot. movie was so dark. Dark. It's so unforgiving. Unforgiving? What are you it's talking about? It's so heavy about? to watch that my lids felt like they were like <laughs> lead on my eyelids. See, I didn't sit next to John, so he was lucky because he got time, to sleep without me going like this to him. But you can't sleep if you're a critic. Can I express myself no, about this film? No, but you can doze. Oh my God! He plays this uh, man with these two children who he's madly no, in love with. Tell the story. Wait, wait. Let me tell you. He he has um he has a, a crazy ex-wife, and he's basically dealing with all these profound just uh, when subjects. you just when you thought something good was going to happen, another bad turn. The guy. Well, no, he's dying. He's dying. dying. He's dying. Well, you know that right off the film. I'm not spoiling it. He it, the film hits on areas of spirituality and and life after death you know, and, and the, forgiveness. You, you know, the only, thing, the only and, thing this film hit for me is that I couldn't wait to get out of the theater. You know what? I, I have nothing to say to that. I'm really disappointed in your lack of artistry when it comes to movies kiss like this. Me, you I don't want to kiss, kiss you. Kiss I only me. kiss people that love this film. I love film. the film. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You know what? The film is a beautiful, beautiful film. I'm not going to tell you what it is, but it's about a man that no, is we searching for very profound, good, good. profound understandings good, in his good, life. Good. Out of five bagels, I am giving this film four bagels because I thought it was absolutely magnificent. Uno. Uno, uno bagel. Uno bagels. You know, I lose respect for you to say uno bagels. It opens in theaters, I think, December 29th. Do not miss this film. What's a man to do?